<laughs> oh, here, here come a couple ladies. Let's get them, get them. <laughs> Good shot. Oh shit. actually felt cold in Thailand. Yeah. I think it's actually in addition to the ice water being poured on me, which that, that shit has got to be close to like freezing temperature because I swear when I was like yelling earlier when those water buckets were being dumped on me, that was involuntary. I did not have a choice. It was that cold. Involuntary shock. Oh, look at all these hot dogs. little watermelons a lot of times they make uh, little milk not milkshakes but I guess smoothie out of the little watermelons and then put the smoothie back into the watermelon and so it's like a, a cup I remember I had one of those uh, not this Christmas but the Christmas uh, like a year and three months ago my first Christmas in Thailand I had one of those on Christmas a watermelon smoothie in the Rhine. So if you guys notice, there's a lot of water, right? But, uh, you know, there's not a lot of bikinis or people with their shirts off. Um, when, when you're a man in Thailand, it's actually illegal to take your shirt off. And so in public. So that's why, I mean, I've got a tank top on and, you know, everybody has got, uh, you know, shirts on. And uh, contrary to popular belief, like as far as um, like con uh, conservative dress goes or whatever, um, traditional Thai culture is actually very conservative in the way <laughs> in the way that uh, women hey hey <laughs> in the way that uh, I'm just gonna let these guys spray me while I keep on going in the way that they uh, the girls dress is very uh, conservative and so. Um, in traditional Thai culture, actually, the girls don't wear bikinis. It's, it's only, I mean, it's not appropriate for a girl to wear a bikini to the beach in Thailand. Uh, it, unless it's a foreigner. They kind of accept that, you know, they, you know, foreigners just do that. But it's like Thai girls that are normal Thai girls, they like bikinis and they want to wear them. But it's totally culturally unacceptable. It's showing too much skin uh, for their culture. So interesting because, I mean, a lot of people wouldn't have thought that. <laughs> hey, uh, say hi to America. 
America. So what is up? Yeah. Oh. There's a foam party. A children's children's foam party going on here. friends. on a lot of chicks, as you can see. He just now cold approached this girl. This guy is one of the, uh, he used to be my next door neighbor. He is a serious player. There's a party area. Hey! <laughs> There's some more trucks coming. I might uh... <laughs> Big ass water fight happening across the street, damn it. I went to the wrong side of the street. I have to cruise back over there now. It's a smurf. Hello, hello, hello.
More water trucks. <laughs> hey! Alright, now this is the street. This is the bar street. So, here is where things should be getting crazy. You gotta have a sense of humor on Songkran. You definitely cannot come to Thailand and go outside on Songkran unless you have a sense of humor. water again. Oh god, those ice buckets, I swear. Yeah, excruciating pain for about two seconds, and then it's over. Get the tuk tuk. <laughs> these, these girls are ready to spray me. The nurses are ready to spray me. <laughs> oh my god, ice water syringe. <laughs> See that syringe? You sprayed me with an ice water syringe. <laughs> Oh, you want to get me? <laughs> oh, that's cute. With a little baby. Wants to spray the foreigner. for me. Actually, like fairly cold right now. So what do you got? I don't need any. <laughs> oh god! Right in my ear, you asshole. party group. They're feeling it. They are feeling it.
fucking crazy. This is the biggest holiday in Thailand. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can see that because there's really no other holiday anywhere else in the world that's like this. The entire country is like this. Like every street in every city in the entire country is doing this right now. I just really like to have fun. I don't want any more of that ice water from that old guy. Oh, the fuck that. Okay. Hello. Looks like we've got a demolition team here. Hello. <laughs> the trucks driving down the street make some crown probably twice as fun. Oh, uh, yeah, that wasn't completely ice water, about half ice on it. Hey!
Now I'm sneaky. There's some troublemakers in front of me, so flipped on the camera just in case. 